what we're going to be doing now is I'm going to show you some of the options that you can use to work with your cloud monitor. Now, the main one here is just the dash dash help. So I'm going to put that up here and I'm just going to go dash dash help. And what you can see here is these are all of the options of stuff that you can do to make sure that it's set up and calibrated properly for you. On your first run, one of the things you want to do is you want to do your cloud monitor. You want to do your dash dash plan, and then you want to add your theme to it and maybe your time zone. So that's what we're going to do here. We're going to go cloud monitor dash dash plan. There we go. Now it's updating to the max 20. So it knows where I'm at. And now it's formatted to exactly what I do, what I use, which is excellent. Yes. So all of this information is here. So another way that we can do this is actually pretty cool as well. So there's some different usage blocks that you can work with in terms of styling it and getting it to go. This one is called MPX CC usage blocks dash live. Now we're just going to get this. We're going to click yes, and it's going to load it up a little differently than it was before. Here we go. So now I really like this version too. It kind of livens it up a little bit from what we're used to, and it makes it a little easier to read. So we have your sessions, your usage and your projection which is all great. 